Hey everybody, this is Bloody Hatchets, and I am back with another awesome tutorial. This one here is going to be on this cool looking motorcycle. I hope that you all enjoy this video, and now let's go ahead and get this started. Alright guys, as you see there's a lot of detail packed into this motorcycle and you can customize this motorcycle to be any color that you want it to be. So now I'm going to go ahead and put one right over here. I'm going to go ahead and start with the tires using the cold block. I'm going to put the front tire right here, skip two blocks and place the back tire just like that. Then I'm going to go ahead and put these stone buttons on these tires. Now once you have that, go ahead and grab your item frames and place on these tires. Then you're going to want to take your web and put the web in the item frame to make it have spokes in these tires. Just like that. Now go ahead and put your first armor stand just like this and make it have this pose right here. Now as you see, the arms of the armor stand are the handlebars to this motorcycle. Now let's go ahead and put the iron pressure plate in this just like that. That way it'll have a mirror. Now let's go ahead and choose what color we want this motorcycle to be. For example this one over here I, I made more of a green color so as you see I put a zombie head on there with the green leather tunic, green carpet, green banner. This one over here I put a iron helmet the chain link armor on there and went more of a darker blue color and that one over here I did more of a diamond color again you can customize these I think I'm just gonna go ahead and choose the easy way out and put the gold chest plate on here and also the gold helmet now go ahead and get your cobblestone wall and you're gonna come up just like this and place one right on top of this armor stand now choose your choice of fence gate. I'm going to go ahead and put an oak one right here. Now come up with your regular piston just like this and make sure you face it down. Go ahead and get rid of these and power this piston to push all this into place just like that. Now go ahead and put your temporary block there, power it once again and let's get rid of this. Now this is guys what you should have. So now let's go ahead and put your second armor stand right here. So let's take a temporary block, come up like this, and we're going to place the second armor stand on that block. Then we're going to choose the same color as we chose before, the gold, and we're going to make it have this pose just like this. And we're going to go ahead and push this armor stand closer to the handlebars. So to do that, you're going to want to come up with a temporary block to hold it from going too far and then you're going to want to take your piston and face it just like this power that piston up to push it up against that block now go ahead and make sure that you delete the piston before the redstone block go ahead and get rid of this and drop it right into place now once you've got that come back up with your temporary block like this here and place your third and final armor stand on this block facing just like this now this one you need to put the iron chest plate on and this one here you're going to go ahead and make it have this pose right here that way that the arms are the pipes so make sure it has this pose and let's go ahead and drop that right into place and once you've got that very carefully delete this block up under so it all falls right into place guys Alright, so now what you need to do is choose your choice of half slab. As you see here, I went more of a dark. Here's acacia that's quartz down there. I'm going to choose the sandstone on this one. And now what you need to do is take an anvil and you're going to drop it into place. But first, you're going to want to take a temporary block. Whatever block you guys have your uh, motorcycle setting on, you're going to choose that block. So you're going to come up like this. And you're going to push that block right into place. You're going to put a temporary block there and power it again. That way your 
uh, base block, whatever block that your motorcycle is sitting on, it will be right into place just like this. Alright, awesome. Now take your anvil and place it off that half slab to let it drop right into place just like that. And now go ahead and place your choice of colored carpet on there. It's best to choose the same color. And now pick the same color banner and place it on there. You know what? What I like to do is put a stripe in this banner. So I'm going to go ahead and get a crafting table real quick. And I'm going to go ahead and place the banner right here. And then take the ink sacks and come up the middle here to make a black stripe on this yellow banner. I think that looks a little bit better. I'm going to place it right there. And go ahead and place your item frame right there. And then your redstone block in the item frame for a tail light. Alright guys, there you go. There's your motorcycle. I hope that you will all hit that like button guys. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you guys think down below. And I'll see you all next time.